Welcome to the Windows channel and this is a little tips and tricks video again. This one is about something that a lot of people don't actually know but when you go to the device manager and you look at drivers a lot of people don't know that actually there are some drivers that are invisible. Mostly drivers that have to do with uh, anything that is emulated or that are sometimes temporary to specific tasks and of course they are part of the drivers that maybe sometimes can cause problems with different peripherals of hardware that's plugged on your PC. So when you go to the device manager of course on Windows 7 you can go to the control panel system and uh, device manager in Windows 8, Windows 10 you can right click the start button go to device manager you can search for the device manager also at the top there's something called view and when you click there you have show hidden devices when you click here you'll see that your list will suddenly expand there are lots of devices like for example storage volume shadow copies um, all sorts of uh, things that are temporary you know like print print queues for example uh, everything that can be in emulation uh, is often a hidden device anything that's not officially now working is often not shown here but can show up in the hidden devices so that you'll know everything that can at some point connect to your computer so if one of the devices that is a temporary device something you use but not leave it plugged in all the time is causing issues well if you haven't plugged it in it might not show up in the device manager but it might show up in the hidden devices because it knows that these are devices that are possibly going to be used at some point so remember that there is in the device manager hidden drivers that are not always being shown and all you have to do is go to view and make sure you have a little check mark in front of show hidden devices but for the um, the more simple side of usually what we do in the device manager is with devices that are officially working or hardware that are uh, that is in Windows right now often I'll never leave that on because it makes the list very long and makes it a little complex sometimes to find what you want so I use it mostly to see uh, devices that might not show up here but might be a cause of problems in the drivers for uh, the hardware in Windows if you have any comments questions suggestions let us know if you enjoy our videos please subscribe give us thumbs up hope you enjoy our videos Thank you for watching.